Ladies and gentlemen, this is the moment you've all been waiting for. It's time to watch Fight World! Mukko Krokop Filipovic, also known as the High Kick Killer, is a Croatian former professional mixed martial artist and kickboxer. He is widely recognized for his devastating left high kick, which has earned him the nickname Crow Cop born on September 10, 1974, in Vinkovci, Croatia, Filipovic had a successful career in both kickboxing and mixed martial arts. Here are some memorable wins by Mirko Crow Cop Filipovic in kickboxing and MMA. Mirko Crow Cop vs. Mark Hunt the fight between Crow Cop and Hunt was highly anticipated, as both fighters were known for their striking abilities and knockout power. Crow Cop, with his lethal left high kick, aimed to showcase his precision striking, while Hunt relied on his heavy hands and durability. Ultimately, Mirko Crow Cop emerged victorious, winning the fight by unanimous decision. It was a closely contested match, with Crow Cop's striking accuracy and aggression earning him the judges' favor. The victory over Hunt became one of Crow Cop's most celebrated moments in his career. It showcased his precision and devastating power, adding to his reputation as a fearsome competitor in the heavyweight division. Mirko Crow Cop vs. Gabriel Gonzaga In the bout, Crow Cop showcased his striking skills and looked to avenge his previous loss to Gonzaga. The fight was a back and forth battle, with both fighters having their moments. In the third round, Mirko Crow Cop landed a powerful strikes that connected with Gabriel Gonzaga. Gonzaga was unconscious and Crow Cop capitalized on the opportunity, following up with ground strikes. The referee stepped in and stopped the fight, declaring Mirko Crow Cop the winner by TKO. It was a significant victory for Crow Cop, the fight between Crow Cop and Gonzaga at UFC Fight Night 64 is remembered as a memorable moment in their respective careers. Mirko Crow Cop vs. Pat Berry in the first round, both fighters showcased their striking skills, with Crow Cop landing his trademark left high kicks and Barry displaying his powerful punches. The fight was back and forth, with both fighters having their moments. In the third round, Crow Cop found an opportunity to capitalize. He landed a left hook that dropped Barry to the canvas. Sensing the opportunity, Crow Cop quickly transitioned to the ground and secured a rear naked choke submission, forcing Barry to tap out. It was a memorable victory for Mirko Crow Cop, demonstrating his resilience and ability to capitalize on openings. The fight against Pat Berry showcased his striking power and grappling skills. Mirko Crow Cop vs. Anthony Parash In their matchup, Crow Cop displayed his striking prowess and controlled the fight from the beginning. He utilized his striking combinations and powerful kicks to keep Parash on the defensive. In the second round, Crow Cop landed a clean left hook that dropped Parash to the canvas. Sensing the opportunity to finish the fight, Crow Cop followed up with ground strikes, prompting the referee to step in and stop the fight. Mirko Crow Cop won the bout via TKO in the second round. The victory against Anthony Parash was an impressive performance by Crow Cop, showcasing his striking skills and finishing ability. Mirko Crow Cop vs. Eddie Sanchez In their bout, Crow Cop showcased his striking skills and overwhelmed Sanchez with a barrage of punches and kicks dropped Sanchez, followed by ground strikes that prompted the referee to step in and stop the fight, declaring Crow Cop the winner. It was an impressive performance by Mirko Crow Cop, highlighting his renowned knockout power and precision striking abilities. Mirko Crow Cop vs. Jerome Le Banner In their encounter, both Crow Cop and Le Banner showcased their striking skills and toughness. The fight was highly anticipated, as both fighters had established themselves as top contenders in the heavyweight division. Crow Cop delivered a devastating left, securing his victory in the tournament. The win over Le Banner was a significant milestone in Crow Cop's kickboxing career. It solidified his reputation as a dangerous striker and further established his prowess with the left high kick, earning him the nickname the High Kick Killer. Mirko Crow Cop vs. Mike Bernardo During the fight, Crow Cop and Bernardo engaged in a high stakes battle, with both fighters showcasing their striking abilities and determination. Bernardo, known for his powerful punches, aimed to impose his aggressive style on Crow Cop, while Crow Cop relied on his technical skills and devastating left high kick. He unleashed a left high kick that sent Bernardo crashing to the canvas, earning Crow Cop the tournament championship. 
This victory over Bernardo at the K1 World Grand Prix 2001 final was a significant achievement for Crow Cop. It showcased his striking prowess, particularly his lethal left high kick, and solidified his reputation as a dangerous contender in the heavyweight division. Mirko Crow Cop vs. Igor Vovchanchin The fight between Crow Cop and Vovchanchin was highly anticipated, as both fighters were known for their knockout power and aggressive fighting styles. Crow Cop unleashed a flurry of strikes on Vovchanchin, culminating in a crushing left high kick that knocked him out, demonstrating his accuracy and precision. The win over Vovchanchin showcased Crow Cop's accuracy, timing, and knockout power. It added to his reputation as one of the most dangerous strikers in the heavyweight division of mixed martial arts. Mirko Crow Cop vs. Dos Caras Jr. Dos Caras Jr., a professional wrestler, stepped into the MMA cage to challenge Crow Cop. Despite his wrestling background, Dos Caras Jr. was a relative newcomer to MMA compared to Crow Cop, who was already an established force in the sport. Crow Cop delivered a picture perfect left high kick to Dos Caras Jr., immediately sending him to the canvas and securing a spectacular knockout victory. The victory over Dos Caras Jr. showcased Crow Cop's lethal left high kick and his ability to finish fights with his striking prowess. It further solidified his reputation as a dangerous striker in the heavyweight division of MMA. Mirko Crow Cop vs. Alexei Ignashov From the opening bell, both fighters displayed their skills and power. Crow Cop showcased his devastating left high kick against Ignashov, delivering a powerful blow that sent him crashing to the mat, resulting in a stunning knockout. The victory over Ignashov added to Crow Cop's reputation as a dangerous striker in the kickboxing world. It highlighted his ability to finish fights with his precision and power, solidifying his status as one of the top contenders in the heavyweight division. Mirko Crow Cop vs. Remy Bonjaski During the fight, both fighters demonstrated their respective strengths. Crow Cop showcased his powerful strikes and aggressive style, while Bonjaski displayed his superior movement and counter-attacking abilities, rendering him unconscious and advancing to the final. During his MMA career, Crow Cop faced notable opponents such as Wanderlei Silva, Josh Barnett, Mark Hunt, and Gabriel Gonzaga, among others. His high kick knockouts became legendary. In addition to his MMA and kickboxing career, Crow Cop also had a background in law enforcement. He served as a member of the Croatian Police Special Forces, which added to his reputation as a tough and disciplined fighter. In recent years, Crow Cop has announced his retirement from professional fighting due to various injuries. However, his impact on combat sports and his devastating left high kick have solidified his status as one of the most iconic and respected fighters in the history of MMA and kickboxing. That's all from this video. We will see you in the next one.